Hi YouTube, it's Honest J here. Just coming through with a very quick little honest tidbit for all the mothers, single mothers, um, grandparents raising little girls. Particularly if you have a little girl in your life, someone who is, um, I don't know, between, when I say little, I mean little, like between the ages of 2 and 7, 2 and 10. Please. Please, for the love of the edges of women in the world, please stop putting weave and fake hair in your toddler's hair. That little girl who still has baby teeth coming in should not have her little poor little brains pulled out because mommy doesn't want a little bald headed little baby. I don't want a bald headed baby. No, my girl, my little baby is not going outside looking like no boy. Well, listen, sometimes when you have birth to a child, they might have your hair consistency. And if you are currently wearing hair weave because your hair consistency to you is unmanageable, then that child is not going to be born with, you know, these lo long flowing locks like Samson. Like, just get over it. Teach your little girls, your toddlers, these these young, f fragile, so impressionable gems of our society, of our future, to just work with God has given you. Before you try to tamper with it, before you try to fake it and sew it in, I swear, I was going to show pictures. In my other edits of this video, I showed pictures on my phone, evidence of little girls sitting in a chair at three years old getting weave sewn into her head. But I said, you know what? I don't have ownership over any of these pictures. Um, I don't want to be in prison. Orange does not look very good on me. So I probably shouldn't show these pictures. And then one of my followers might be like, oh my god, I know that girl. That's so-and-so's daughter or niece. Or okay, I'm not trying to offend anyone to that degree. I'm just being honest. Jay. I think it's an atrocity. It's an epidemic. Those girls are never going to know what the edges of their hair look like or what their edges could have been because you don't want a bald-headed baby. Get uh, Hello, sometimes babies are bald-headed. I do want to show one picture that I found. Just to wrap things up, I didn't want to make this long. Just something quick about what was on my mind and how irritating it is to me to see parents being so selfish that you won't allow your child to go through a normal phase of not having a lot of hair. Like, come on, chill out. Anyway, this is what I miss kids looking like. I found this picture on the internet during my search for just the most outrageous hair weaves on children. And I found this doll, this gem, that reminds me of the way my mother did our hair. And I'm not that old. Like, I'm only in my 30s, so it's not like I'm from, you know, 1960-something. This was just a few decades ago. But isn't she gorgeous? Can you see that? Okay. Cute. That's her hair. It's not a lot. But, I mean, she's a baby. She's not freaking Kim Kardashian with just flowing locks of hair like she's been alive for 30 years. She's a baby. She's going to get hair. Don't sew it in. Don't braid it in with braid extensions like for crying out loud. Let that child's edges have a chance. I'm done. Honest J, over and out. Love y'all.